If you watched my previous What I Ate in a Day video, then you know I love starting my day with a big glass of water. It really helps hydrate you and kickstarts your metabolism. And today I am drinking a glass out of a brand new water filter that I just got, which I absolutely adore. And then after I drink my water, I head out for a walk with Trevi, usually about half an hour or so. After my walk, I usually work out and then take a shower, do my meditation, and then it's time for breakfast. So today for breakfast, I started with a matcha latte, which includes organic matcha tea powder, ashwagandha root powder, which is a medicinal mushroom, monk fruit extract, which is an alternative to stevia, and then MCT oil, which gives you a ton of energy. So I do about a teaspoon of matcha powder, probably a half a teaspoon of ashwagandha root powder, just a little sprinkle of the monk fruit extract because you don't need a lot, and then two teaspoons of MCT oil, and then I just pop the thing, this is my Blendtec blender, I pop that onto the base and I add in some boiling water. And you can add some milk if you want, but I just use boiling water today. And then I just blend it for maybe 15 seconds. And you can see that it gets nice and frothy. Um, that's because of the oil. Look at that foam, it's so pretty. And then I just pour it into a mug and it is ready to go. It's so delicious. Like it's sweet, but it's not coyingly sweet. And it's like thick and creamy and it's super healthy. It gives me a great boost in the morning and I absolutely love it. Next up on the menu is some green juice. This is actually some cold pressed green juice that I got at Whole Foods and it has a bunch of yummy goodies. Um, it's sold in a 32 ounce container, which is awesome. So I just poured myself a glass of that. And then the food portion, which is obviously the best part, this is my high protein carrot cake chia pudding, which I posted on the blog yesterday. I'll leave a link in the description below. And this one I actually topped with some carrots and sliced banana. And I'm also gonna add some almond butter that I made at home and also some bee pollen, which is high in vitamin Bs, which is great for energy and awesome in the morning. So I'm just doing like a dollop of almond butter and then just a little sprinkling of the bee pollen and that's it. Then it's time to dig in. So here's my spread. You've got the carrot cake chia pudding, the matcha latte, some water with lemon, and my green juice. And overall, it was like super filling and it tasted so good. Everything, I loved it. This chia pudding, I swear you guys, it tastes like dessert, but it is like the best thing ever. And it kept me full for literally hours. I'm not even kidding. And then of course the matcha latte, such a great way to start the day. So for my snack today, I was not really that hungry and I was going out to lunch. So I started just with the tea. This is the healthy fasting tea from Yogi Tea. I absolutely love it. And I love that Yogi Tea has little quotes. So today's was, our intuition comes from innocence. So sweet. And then I also just had a few strawberries. They were organic. Um, they tasted delicious. They're not quite in season yet, so they weren't totally uh, sweet, but they were so yummy. And then for lunch, lunch, I actually had a lunch date with a girl that I am working with named Michelle, and she is absolutely amazing. We met at the Le Pain Cotidien, I guess that's how you say it, um, in Central Park. So I had a beautiful walk through Central Park and then arrived at Le Pain for lunch with her, and it's so cute. They're all really cute. Their menu is amazing. This is our view from lunch looking out on Central Park. How perfect is that? My favorite thing on the menu is the lentil and avocado salad, and it comes with gluten-free bread, which is so delicious. I also love the avocado toast, but today I was feeling the roast turkey and avocado tartine, which I actually subbed the turkey for hummus. Alongside the lunch, I got a hot water with lemon. It was a little chilly outside, so this kind of warmed me up. And then when lunch came, so good. So two slices of toast with avocado, hummus, cucumbers, radishes, some arugula, and then just I cracked some fresh pepper and salt on it, and I was in heaven. So after our meeting, I got home and I took Trevi for a little walk and I was really hungry so I had a snack of just a couple figs before dinner and I love dried figs, one of my favorites, and I had three and it was the perfect snack before dinner. So normally I make dinner at home but tonight I didn't because we are actually in the process of getting our kitchen renovated and had zero cabinets. So here's a sneak peek at what it looked like this morning. We actually have cabinets now which is great but the kitchen is not really functional. So I decided to get a salad from my favorite place, which is Sweet Green, which is right around the corner. It's on 75th on Amsterdam, and this is like my happy place. This place is so amazing. It's basically just a fresh salad bar, but everything is really healthy. But they also have um, really great high quality ingredients. It comes from local farms, and they tell you where it's all from. So they have tons of variety. I usually just build my own with a bunch of different veggies. Um, 
And tonight I just picked all of my faves. I went with grilled asparagus, which is on their new spring menu. I chose sweet potatoes. I of course got some chickpeas because I love chickpeas. I also got some beets and some cucumber, some cabbage. And then my favorite dressing that they have is the carrot chili vinaigrette. And so that's what I use to top it. And look at that salad, is that not delicious? Oh my gosh, it's so good. So when I got home, I wanted to add in some extra fat. I had an avocado that was about to go bad. So yeah, see, it's a little icky looking, but that's okay. Um, sliced it up, topped it, and that was dinner. So simple. Of course, I sat in my PJs on the couch because that's how I always eat dinner and it was delicious. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. You guys rock, love you, bye.